Hi, I'm Ellen, a physio at My Physio SA, and today we're going to go through some different exercises to help massage and release the muscles through the fronts and sides of our thighs. So when we're using the roller, it's nice to set ourselves up so we've got mid-thigh on the roller, so that when we push back and forth, we're able to get that full span of the legs without having to commando crawl along the floor. So I start with my leg mid-thigh, and what this is going to do is massage just down the straight front of my thigh. But there's other areas we want to get to as well. So what I like to do, just easing into your rolling, is I turn my toes out to the side or point my heels towards each other. Now I'm getting a straight line down the inner part of my thigh. And that can be a little bit uncomfortable, maybe for people that have got some knee injuries or hip injuries. We can roll through there. To get a little bit on the outer part of the thigh, what I can do is I can turn my toes towards each other. I might open my legs a little bit wider or a little bit narrower so that you can get the best possible position. And again, I'm just rolling up towards my hips, down towards my knees, and I'm getting that slightly outer thigh. To increase it a little bit further, what we can do is we can point both our feet in one direction. I sometimes think of this like a tightrope. So I'm getting a little bit further around on my inner thigh and a little bit further around on my outer thigh as well, coming all the way up towards the hip, all the way down towards the knee. And then we can do the same thing in the opposite direction. Pointing both feet in line with one another, like you're walking on a tightrope, getting the inner thigh on one leg, outer thigh on the other. Now, if you want to increase that further and move a little bit further around the thigh, what we can do is we can come onto the side here, remembering that we can rotate a little bit further forward or rotate a little bit further back. So I can use this leg to help me and gently roll back and forth again, coming all the way up towards the hip, all the way down towards the knee. I can intensify that rolling slightly forward, rolling slightly back. Probably the firmest you'll be able to get it is both feet stacked, one on top of the other. So I'm still on my mid thigh and I'm rolling up towards the hip, down towards the knee. Now if we want to get more of the inner thigh, what we would do is we'd change our position and we can bring our hip up to a 90 degree angle, starting in the middle of the thigh again, but this time we're rolling out to the side. As always, there's different parts of the leg that you can get to. So if I bring my heel up towards the ceiling, I'm going to go a little bit more at the front of the thigh, going all the way towards the hip, all the way out towards the knee. Or I can drop my heel down towards the floor, getting a little bit further back on the inner thigh. And then you can do the other side if you need to. As always, it's most important to talk to your physio before engaging in any of these activities. When I'm doing these kind of exercises at home, I think about doing 30 seconds through the front of my thighs, 30 seconds on the inside, 30 seconds on the outside, and adding an additional 30 seconds if you want to do any of those more challenging variations.